that uh, Cliff Height was a guy who decided that Ben Roethlisberger wasn't That's not part of this press conference. So when it talks about talent, just everything you said about you, keep it, keep it, take a grain of salt. All right, Jungle Jack, my dear buddy. Well, obviously I have some notes here, but uh, I'm going to put those aside and speak to the heart like I've always done most of my life, whatever the business I've been in, that the animal business. Uh, and also, uh, let everybody know that I appreciate the work that you guys have done. The governor, no one appreciates it more than myself and other animal people. Uh, this was one of the most difficult times of my entire life. I've had a difficult time with our daughter dying several times with cancer, as John knows. And I've had to pick up a little more arm that was taken off my African wife. And I could go on, we all have a terrible time in life. But this has to be one of those moments, those 38 hours, that I'll never forget. I dream about it. As Sheriff Cook, most, and Sheriff, I'd like you to come up here because everybody refers to you, but I think they don't realize that this man come up here because this man, everybody, saved not a human life, he saved human lives. I know that because of my experience with these animals. These animals are capable of taking down a person, and I wouldn't even say a child, in less than 10 seconds, the ones that John referred to. It's amazing what John said. I love one thing he said. He said a lot of great things. But the one thing that stands out is the love that these people that have these animals, because we know this, they really have a love. But the difference in the love of being able to do some of these things, and by the way, let's make it very clear, we're not taking anything from anybody. That's what I heard. But we're taking things. We're taking animals from people who love them. We're not taking anything. We're setting a bill forward here that will help everyone, including the people world as well as the animal world. And that's what's great about the bill as I see it. Yes, I've received phone calls and letters recently about how I got to do it back in the 70s. And that's true. The things change, just as I refer to it one more time. Just like when the hockey puck, and we know Mr. McConnell very well, the found the Blue Jackets, went over that net that day and killed that beautiful 12 year old uh, or the young girl at her birthday party. They put nets up behind there. Same thing with NASCAR when the car went over. They put the, the, the fencing up. Same thing here, something happened in Ohio. By the way, everyone, it wasn't because, and they know this, I was criticized just lying on the floor because I had documented by one of the legislators that said, Jack, stay out of our business here, we'll pass it at this in time. It wasn't me that won this. It was Anderson Cooper, Diane Sawyer. Have you ever gotten calls from the media, because I do a lot of these news shows? Because not just the state of Ohio, everyone. This wasn't the United States. This is the world watching. Now, whatever happens here today news-wise, I can tell you this. Won't just be seen in Ohio. Won't be just seen in the United States. It will be seen throughout the world because the world is watching Ohio. And now we can all be very proud of what we're setting here, what these guys work so hard on as a governor and all his staff. What you're setting here is a precedent for those states that have no laws as well. And God forbid if anything would ever happen in those states with these animals. Because I can tell you, it could have, but it didn't, thanks to the, again, the work. It was much more difficult than I thought. I'm not a politician, everybody, so I don't know what goes on, what you guys have to go through. But now I have more of appreciation of what had to be done. And I just am proud to be in Ohio. I always say this, I'm proud to go on whatever all these shows I do and say Columbus, Ohio, the state of Ohio, to represent it on nine, uh, three of our shows, the state of Ohio, every single weekend to almost six million people. I'm very proud of Ohio. When this happened, it not only hurt me because I had to witness hearing the animals' shots all night long when the, the snipers and Sheriff Let's Knows were crying themselves the next day after doing this, so I know what it felt like because I was there. And I'm glad none of you were there. But the thing is, we don't ever hope we have to go through this again thanks to all this work here, this man right here. So I guess, John, it's, it's an honor for me. I've never been at a bill signing, but Praise the Lord for this bill, as John said, he just been in office. This is something, everyone, that went around the world. When my daughter from England called me at 4 in the morning, Kathleen, who's done these shows, raised animals our wife, said, Dad, why are you shooting these animals? It says right here in the paper, front page of London Times. I'm not shooting anything, Kathleen. We're trying to save human lives here. And that's what we did. And again, we're not taking, these people have some of these animals, are great people, we're not taking anything. We're just trying to have some, a bill here to protect everyone, animals and people life as well. So it's a privilege, John, to be here. And thank you guys from the bottom of my heart uh, and body for the animal world as well and all of us for what you've done.